Hi, it's me again with Corolla Roll Tips and Tricks. I'm going to attempt to show you how to draw a vine, and I could have put more leaves on it, using the artistic media tool to give it a thinner line. So I've already drawn a leaf, and that's just combining two circles and making an object out of it. But I'm going to take the three-point curve line, and I'm going to put a little curve to it. Now I'm going to go to the artistic media tool, and with this one right here, it's kind of got a tail on it. I've got it upside down, but that doesn't matter. I can flip it in a minute. Uh, matter of fact, we could, uh, you know, your uh, mirror tool right there. I'm actually going to try to go ahead and, uh, maybe just rotate it. Now, inside the artistic media tool is a line, or inside the artistic. So I'm going to left click, right click, and then go to object and break. Sometimes you got to grab it. Artistic media, media apart. I'm going to take that and I'm going to nudge it out of the way. I'm going to use that for my blend of path because you've got two lines over here. So I just took a two circles and made a, a leaf looking thing. I'm going to hit the plus key and I'm going to mirror it, probably even rotate it, get the four point cross. And I'm going to put it like right there and I'm going to group those together. I'm actually going to put them like right there. Maybe rotate them a little bit more. <clears throat> then I'm going to hit the plus key on the keyboard and I'm going to go up here and I'm going to rotate them a little bit the other way, but I'm also going to make them smaller. So I'm going to take this outside handle and put it pretty close to the center of the stem. Then I'm going to shift select my larger leaf. I'm going to go to effects and blend. I'm going to blend uh, eight times this time. And then I'm going to go down here to blend a new path. And what you're doing, you're going to blend to your artistic media path. We're going to take all this. We're going to go to object, break the blend apart. And we should be able to move that out of the way. Now, this is still a group in the middle. I don't really think it matters, but I'm going to ungroup it. And I'm going to nudge it right back to there. As long as they're kind of all in the center, this will work. And then I'm going to go and I'm going to weld it. And then I'm going to turn it black. And I could have played around with it a lot more. But as you can see, your stem, and I did not... Uh, you know, go to uh, blend a full path or a long full path, I could have got it at the very bottom. But if you didn't like that, you could very easily take your shape tool and just delete some nodes and do whatever you want to with it. Pretty cool. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.